All right, guys, what's good? I'm back today. Um, I actually didn't want to go over Bohan's EZA because it is out on JB, and I completely forgot to go over it. So yeah, I did not. I, I just noticed something. I did not know he was on the artificial life forms category. I mean, because I never like so expected it to be. I never noticed that until now. So yeah, like um, and also um, the Doken um, wiki page they did actually update, or you can actually see the EZA in the transcendent um UR version. Um, they should be like, like you know, TUR should like trans because they never like say that in Doken. They did, but it just says regular UR. It should be like a T there, you know, if, if for the next update. Because I know they're getting like a subscription, um, like thing. I know I still need to go over that. Um, so for his easy, he does keep us for everything up 100%, which is amazing. Like, these other skills are like really just broken because we all have 150%. It's like these other skills are really good. Um, then he has um, his vice shout, which are like I think it's different now. But before he has vice shout because it used to be um because they um all used to be what immense damp no yeah they always used to be immense damp but that was like oh oh because okay now I feel dumb so is it only what two super attacks this time yeah because his super coming how it's gone well this oh oh no because you only got you had to raise that for a level when you get up to level five that's when he gets vice shout he gets vice shout um give me one second I'm still trying to scroll down and I'll get there um. So yeah, so for him, um, then after he does immense damage, uh, for his first one, he lowers attack and defense, which is always good though, like even Inko Jeep does that. Um, and he does immense damage and, um, great, um, with greater power and, um, and greatly lowers attack and defense. Uh, I guess, like, it, it just basically increases his power, um, basically just increases his black modifier. So for him, he does attack plus 17%, and defense plus 10%, and recover 10,000, um, HP per key for a turn. So basically, if you get a whole field, you'll cover, like, what? I mean, for each key, like, for what? Like, per key sphere, that's what, 10,000? That's like, what? I mean, for every key sphere, that's like, what? Like, five on each row? I don't know, I still got, I'll do the math and stuff, I'll probably tell you guys. It recovers, what, 15% uh, health, um, HP when, um, delivering the final ball. Basically, when he's, um, after he beats enemy, he recovers 15 HP. Which is good, though, I mean, it's, it's a slight recovery, but it's still really good. That's really clutch. Um, Majin, so Zinx are Majin, oh, yeah, everybody should know Royal Zinx and stuff. Because the Silver's category is on Majin Boost, Saga, Transformation Boost, and we already knew that. And all the official lots for him. So he's a really good unit. Um, the first is easy. It's super, like, simple, but, um, it's gonna get harder as you go on. Basically, Tekken STR units won't really do anything in AGL, like, in Extreme. So basically, Extreme AGL, as regular STR and Tekken units won't do anything. Of course, Tekken units won't do anything. You can bring the Batar team or a regular physical team, because I've seen people dominate. Like, I have, my Batar team is amazing. I still don't have Kefla, but, um, give me one second. I'm trying to change my song. Give me a second. Actually, let me pause. I'm back. I'm back. I had to change my song real quick. It was being funky. So yeah, for Bohan's easy. It's really simple to go through, but I think as you go on, like down here, especially down here, like during the, like the last few stages, you will definitely like it will like get harder because like these type of easy A's, they do get harder as they go on because like, they'll just start tanking and stuff. They'll start like you know doing more damage as the super attack goes on. Remember, Bohan's easy A was really like that one and Super Saiyan three Goku's are really difficult. Well, nowadays I can be like Super Saiyan three Goku easily because last time when I did it, I did I used Double man, I completely just I obliterated him. Um, so yeah, I mean he can break a punching machine, but it's, it's gonna take forever to get his passive off. I want to be what five tries to get his passive off. I can't remember because I had to get him um, on a rotation, and it really like it a buff modifier for him will just go off. But he can't even do it nowadays anymore because they like oh oh yeah Ben is like oh yeah you can't use him anymore because you know he's an SSR you know because he's not even awakened. They should really think about awakening him though, increasing his more of his passive, you know. Maybe that would be kind of broken because he does the most damage in the game. So, you know, I mean, you don't want to keep using that unit over and over and over. Plus, you know, you get a whole bunch of medals, um, or is almost a 90%, like 100%. Um, 11, like, Grand Kaiser, I mean, typical 30 stone. And the Batar team for this one is, like, I mean, just, uh, just like, a little few units. But, um, uh, some, some, some suggestions, I kind of, I hate stuttering. Um, you know, Super Vegito, um, Sebastian Gawas. So, basically, this is, like, a really summonable if category. I mean, you can get, like, some of these... Units. I mean, they have them are really hard to summon because like they're really, the Tar team's really like strict and stuff. Not really strict, but they have a lot of get units. Yeah, like Super Vegito, Vegito Blue, not really. Kefla, Goasu. You use these two because like, they have the same name. We just got to use Kefla, her access R form. I don't know, um, Vegito, but I mean, he doesn't do any more damage, like, past that point, but, um, LR Vegito. I mean, he does come back on the 40th anniversary, so, you know, um, I mean, for, for guys on JP, crap, I mean, for Global and stuff, you know, you can try to like, at least try to get him for the 40 anniversary, so we can have like a little bit, a little bit of advantage ahead. You know, extra drones if you want to, um, you know, get them if you want to. That's like what 30, 
Um, how much? If you want to do like the verb math. Oh. Wow, I'm done. I'm done. I'm so done. You don't give me. I'm so what? 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. 34 stones overall if you want to, you know, do it all. Um, yeah, I mean, Pitar seems very simple, but it's hard because, you know, all these units and stuff. Yeah, just don't bring tech at all. Just bring, you know, simple, you know, units maybe here and there. Oh, yeah, difficult. I did forgot to go over his summons. Um. Oh yeah, for his summons. I completely forgot to go over it. Um, I didn't hear my music. So for him, it's just him, like for him, for the banner. You will get one, um, you know, gotcha coin ticket for um, every five things you use. Yeah, like for most of these, it's like, what, 10? They should do like 50 so you know you can get more. I mean, for Global, they probably would do that, like put random amounts of numbers. Because, you know, Global have to change stuff around. Therefore, um, you get um, Vegito Blue, the OG one. So he's going to I mean, he's going to get replaced. He's... I don't know, he, the way he counters it doesn't do that much damage anymore. Even like with one dupe I have of him, he never crit counters. No deal for like, yeah, he never crit counters for me. Then Bohan, of course, because you know he's the main unit. So yeah, like just mainly those three. So yeah, that's all the like little god stuff I just want to go for. Mohan, he's a really good easy A unit. Um, a lot of people still love Engine Nepo. When he comes Global, he's going to be destructive. Right after Global is Tech ECA Super Saiyan 3 Go Tanks. Which I do need to go. I mean, that's like in a few more days, I think. Or it's, I don't know if it's live yet. I can't, I can't remember. I can't remember if it's um in like around these two days. He has not go over yet. Should be in a few more days though, but I do need to go over that one as well because I like to say like because for me for easy days I like to kind of go over and see like which um unit is like the best so I can like you know for global and JP I kind of like compare no because like for global like more units are, are coming out early and stuff so I kind I want to kind of compare it like the global and JP because you know they're gonna have different cards like you know for global but by the time we get this four versus is gonna be like been passed. No, well, they could bring it early. I don't know. Just saying. See, so, yeah, like they did on um, Kid Goku. Like, basically, I just do like these to compare like the units back and forth. Just compare them like if they're um like the JP counterpart. Like for JP, basically, um, I want to go over like for JP what they can do or Global what they can do when those units come out eventually. Because you know Global and JP have completely different units. You know. Just saying. So yeah, see you guys later. They're still watching. A little bit rambling on, but yeah, see you guys later.